Welcome to the Course Care self-training video series for Cengage Now. Copying a course. This training video will demonstrate the process of copying an existing Cengage Now course and modifying assignments. When copying an existing Cengage Now course, you leave the original course's students behind but you retain all of the original course's assignments. To make a copy of an existing Cengage Now course, navigate to the Courses tab. Within the Courses tab, click on the orange Create a New Course button located on the right side of the page. From the list of processes, choose to copy an existing course, and from the sub-menu, Choose to start with a course already in your account. Click Continue. Select the course that you would like to copy from the Available Courses window. Deselect the Show Only Active Courses to select a course that's no longer active. After selecting the course that you would like to copy, click Continue. The Course Information page will appear. All required fields on the page are indicated with an asterisk. The textbook information from the copied course will pre-populate into the textbook field. Note that a Digital Product Student Will Buy field appears. This is an important piece of information because it determines what content your student should purchase to use the course. The significance of this digital product will be covered more fully later in this video. Enter your desired course name to replace the copy of naming convention. You may optionally add your course number. As for preserving course and assignment dates, here's how this feature works. If you leave the box checked, then no dates from your original course will be changed. If you uncheck this box, you will be able to edit the course start and end date, and all assignments will then use the course start date for the assignment available date, and will use the course end date for the assignment due date. Either way, after course creation, you will have a chance to edit all dates. You should, though, determine which choice will make the least editing work for you. Lastly, if you attached a syllabus to the original course, you may choose to use that syllabus or replace it with a new syllabus. To link to an existing web page syllabus, select Link to this URL and enter the URL into the text field. To upload a Word or PDF version of your syllabus, select Link to this file and browse for your syllabus file. Or select None if you do not want to include a copy of your syllabus within Cengage Now. When finished, click Create Course. Your new course and course information will be displayed on the Course Created page. Note the course key. This is important and we'll return to it in a moment. At this point, your new course is created and will contain assignments from the course you copied. You may want to modify the assignment dates or create additional assignments. You can do this by clicking on the Modify Dates or Create an Assignment links on this page. You can also accomplish this through the Assignments tab. To do so, expand Show All Options to reveal the options to Modify Dates, Delete or Archive Assignments, as well as Create Additional Assignments. Once you have finished adjusting the assignments, you will want to let your students know how to enroll in the course. And this means communicating the course key to your students. Unfortunately, we are no longer on the page that displays the course key, but luckily the information is easy to find. Click on the Courses tab, locate your course, and look in the Course and Section Key column. To aid you in communicating the course key to students, Cengage Now gives you registration instructions. You may choose to print these instructions for handout distribution, email to students, copy to your system clipboard, 
or download a PDF version. Note that the instructions describe purchase of an access code before entering your course and after entering the course. The best experience for your students is accessing the course first before purchase. This allows them to try before they buy and when they are ready to buy, they will be directed to the correct product to purchase so that there are no instances of buying a product that does not fit the course. This buy the correct product functionality is enabled by what was shown earlier in this video. The association of digital product student will buy. Thank you for viewing this training video. For additional resources, please visit the Cengage Now Course Care page. Resources include live and archived online training seminars, self-training videos, user documentation, and first day of class resources for students.